Happy 15th anniversary, Miss BG. Miss BG probably presents Miss BG versus the new babysitter. That's where I'm going tonight. It's not official yet, but I heard Dad tell Mom that he'd get tickets. They must want to surprise me. Or they think you could use the dance tips. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm an excellent dancer. Right, Gad? Uh, right. Though maybe a few tips wouldn't hurt. Is there anything you want to tell me? Well... I know, I know. We're going to the show, right? Did you was listening outside your door last night. That's not true. I had to go to the bathroom. I couldn't help it here as I walked past. Uh, BG, um, about the show... It... Don't worry, I'm ready. So, what time do we leave? Um, now your mother and I... We... I'll get it! Well, here we go. You must be BG. I'm Terry, the babysitter. Oh, Mom! George's babysitter is here! <laughs> Why isn't Aunt Alice babysitting George? Because Aunt Alice got a new job and has to work tonight. Now, <clears throat> about tonight... I know, we're going to be late. Where's Mom? Mom! Hurry up! We've got to go! BG, we have to talk. Now. Oh, this wasn't good. Whenever Dad said we had to talk, I knew I wasn't going to like it. <gasps> I'm not going! I couldn't believe it. I wasn't going to see the show. There was only one thing to do. I just saw the signal. What's going on? My parents have gone to the show, and they didn't take me! That's the emergency? Didn't you hear what I said? I'm not going to the show! And to make things worse, my parents have hired a new babysitter! A new babysitter? Why didn't you say so? Now that's an emergency! I don't get it. Me neither. What's Terry got to do with it? Don't you guys watch TV? All sorts of things can happen. What if this babysitter locks you in your room and takes away your Game Boy? Mom and Dad wouldn't hire someone like that. Oh, yeah? What do you really know about this Terry person? I'm sure she's fine. Easy for you to say. You're not the one who's trapped with her. What am I going to do? I was stuck with Terry for tonight, but there was the future to think of. I had to protect myself <laughs> and George. Before the night was over, I'd have to make sure that Terry never wanted to babysit again. It would be a big job. I'd need some help. Stop! <laughs> Excuse me, but I need to talk to George. Huh? In private. Hey! <sighs> Remember, it's a game. We don't do anything Terry says. Not a thing? Not a thing. I made some brownies. Yay! Hooray! <laughs> Sorry, our parents don't like us to eat sweets before dinner. Well, that makes sense. You can eat them later. Ha. <laughs> so, what should we do? Would you like to play a game of catch? George doesn't like catch. Okay, then how about a board game? George hates board games. Uh. Oh, I see. Well, I guess we'll just have to settle for a movie. I have the new robots feature. Yeah. Hey! Uh. <sighs> but we don't want to watch a movie, do we, George? We do if I get to choose. What a traitor. I was going to need a more reliable partner. Alex, get over here. I need your help. Over. <laughs> Alex has come 
over to play. Is that okay? Sure, no problem. Terry had no idea. It was going to cost me two comic books and my secret stash of candy. Expensive, but it would be worth it. <laughs> Hurry, Terry! Alex is sick! What's wrong? Oh, oh! Alex ate one of your brownies. I think he's got food poisoning. Oh, dear. My stomach hurts. Huh? <coughs> this doesn't look good. Yes, it's pretty bad when you make little kids sick. Maybe you shouldn't babysit anymore. <laughs> Don't worry. I took a babysitting course. I'm trained for emergencies. I'll just pump Alex's stomach. What? You guys stay put. I'll go find a hose. It's okay. I suddenly feel better. What? Is that my mom calling me? I'd better go. Nice to meet you, Terry. Hey! <clears throat> Speedy recovery or not, I wanted my stuff back. It was all going wrong. And not only that, I was hungry. Hey, BG. Uh, want something to eat? Sure. I mean, sure I would. That is, if I was hungry. I'll be in my room. I had to be strong and stick to the plan. Although at this point, I didn't really have one. And that's when it came to me. I suddenly knew what to do. <laughs> I know. Let's play hide and go seek. Okay. Do you want to be it? No, I want you to be it. Count to 50 while George and I hide. And no peeking. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Terry was in for a shock. She'd never find me up here. Forty-nine, fifty. I'm coming! Hmm, now where could they be? <laughs> Hi, good hiding place, huh? That's for sure. up there. Let's look downstairs again. <sighs> Are you sure you don't know of another secret hiding place, George? We checked them all. Oh, then where could she be? Maybe the giant robot ate her. Oh, come on, sweetie. That was just a movie. The robot didn't eat your sister. Trust me. Then where is she? <laughs> Huh? Whoa! <laughs> what did you do to George? BG, where did you go? We searched everywhere. I was mm. worried. I thought the giant robot had eaten you. It's okay, George. I was right here. I was just hiding in the attic. That wasn't very nice. I want my mom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Maybe I should call your parents. My plan had worked, so how come I felt so bad? Terry wanted to leave, but George was upset. Mom and Dad were going to go ballistic. <laughs> George, who am I? I'm Dad, trying to watch TV when I ask him for a cookie. That was easy. How about this? It's Albert when I try to kiss him. <laughs> it's time for bed, George. Come on, I'll read you a story. Want to help, BG? I couldn't give up that easily. Not after all my hard work. My plan could still work if Terry thought I didn't like her. Nah, I'll just play in my room. Oh, well, as long as you're having fun. It wasn't fair. I was the only one who wasn't having fun. And on top of that, I was starving. BG? I'm 
sorry. Was the music too loud? I'll turn it down. No, no, it's fine. I was just practicing some dance moves. I guess you think it's silly. I don't think it's silly. I like that spin you did. Oh, you mean this one? Whoa! Yeah. How do you do that? Here, I'll show you. <laughs> it was decision time. Ignore Terry or learn the coolest spin I'd ever seen. Well, that was a no-brainer. Out, Terry was a great dancer. Not as good as me, of course, but she did teach me a lot of cool moves. This new babysitting thing was gonna work out just fine. 